What's your name, girl? What's yours? <clears throat> your name don't matter. Atop the peak, you'll lose it and get another. You may go. And you? Got something to do up there, so just let us through. <laughs> Given me orders? You? A human? I passed the trial. Here's proof. Recognize it? The Defiers, Orin. A death sentence. No time to lose. I'll turn to Imlarith, you take the crones. Avalarch said they dwell below the oak, among its roots. No chance. I'm going after Imlarith. <sighs> Fine, let's play for it. Rock, paper, scissors. Damn it! Two out of three! Emlareth's a bigger threat than the Crones. I should face him. I'm no worse a fighter than you. We both know that's not true. Listen to me this once. But... No buts. Fine. Be careful. You too. Let's get down there. Oh, hell. I guess I must jump. Return. Your taste lingers on our tongues. You've talked enough. You die tonight. Yeah.
at the summit. Gotta be. Sisters said you would come. They saw you arrive in the water's surface. They did not see the girl, but she is with you, is she not? I'm here alone. A lie which will change nothing. A fight like this. The Witcher you slew. We did it. Barely. How'd it go down there? I slew only two of the crones. The third fled with Vesemir's medallion. 
my sole memento. Coming here? Good idea. I knew we'd succeed. From the start. Now to find Eridin and kill him. An Orin for your thoughts? Wondering what to tell Yennefer when we get to Novigrad. Tell her the truth. Always. I wonder if Triss and Yennefer have found the sorceresses at the lodge. We ought to rejoin them. Give me a minute. I'm old. Need more rest. Hmm. You are, and you do. Let's stay a bit longer. of power should draw from it. Gods protect us. We needn't have come here. We'll ire the ladies. They'll punish us harsh. Too late to undo. Now stop your chattering. So, off to Novigrad then? Yeah, let's get going. Let's go. The oak is dead. The oak, the crones. I fear that was your last feast. What of our acorns? Don't know, don't care. You must learn to live without them. This is no longer no man's land. It's no longer the lady's land. It's all yours. But what are we to do? Come, Geralt. It's time. Manage on your own. Humans. Thought it was mages the hunters and the temple guard were after. Mages left. Hunters needed a new quarry. Hatred and prejudice will never be eradicated. And witch hunts will never be about witches. To have a scapegoat, that's the key. Humans always fear the alien, the odd. Once the mages had left Novigrad, folk turned their anger against the other races, and as they have for ages, branded their neighbors their greatest foes. Your 
Andy Lion. Ready some tankards with guests. Geralt! Siri! When I learned Geralt had found you... Glad to see you in one piece too, Dandelion. What have you two been? Just finished hunting down the crones of Velen and a general of the Wild Hunt. Well, you've been a busy mom then, haven't you? In fact, you look terrible. Like you could really use some rest. Gladly take some. Point me to a room. Of course. Come on, little swallow. I'll take you. Let's meet later, Geralt. I have a little matter to resolve. I'll freshen up, then await you in the square in Gildorf. Right. Anyone here besides us? Lodge of sorceresses. Triss and Yen were supposed to gather the remnants. They're working on it. Triss is upstairs, waiting for you. Yennefer's gone to Crippled Kate's. Yen? At that portside dive? Why? Didn't inform me. Imagine that. Ah, and that elf of yours moved into the Ruby Suite. Told me to tell you he's waiting, too. Gave him your best room? He didn't exactly ask. I prepared another room for him, but he blew past me and locked himself in the Ruby. Hasn't peeked out since. Barely eats, drinks only water, and the only thing I've heard from him is, I wish to know when Windblade and Zeriel arrive. Thanks. Looks like I'll have my hands full. My wife won't believe I'm Siri come to any harm. You know that. Past burning pyres on the way into town. Non-humans on them. Things grow worse by the day. No mage is left in the city, so the hunters had to find someone else to victimize. We need to resolve everything as quickly as possible and leave Novograd. Any success with the Lodge? Anyone out there willing to help? It doesn't look good. Ida outright refused, while Francesca won't budge from her little realm with a war raging. We don't know about Fringilla. Haven't been able to contact her. And the others? Kira? Margarita? Philippa? Kira? I thought you of all people would know. Few can refuse a sorceress, and Kira Metz certainly had her ways. But when she demanded the Mage Alexander's notes, I had to turn her down. Kira needed that, as she needed the impetus to start anew. She found it where she least expected to. Years later, known for discovering the cure for the Catriona Plague, she was thankful none remembered her time in hiding as a village witch. Not seen worse matches. Hope things work out for them. I hope they work out for us, and we actually find Philippa and Rita. Know where they are? Yennefer's looking into Rita's whereabouts. I have to figure out where Philippa is. So, learn anything? A few things that could be interesting. Prefer the long version or the short? Tell me everything. I want the details. After fleeing Loch Muin, Philippa ended up here in Novigrad. She sought help from her former lover, the sorcerer Arthur de Vlister. De Vlister rings a bell. Philippa had made a fool of him once. Arthur was out for revenge. He convinced her she'd be safest as an owl. 
She transformed, and he placed a dimeridium band on her leg. The mage hunt started shortly afterwards. Sadly, Arthur fell victim. They auctioned off his estate. Just so happened a certain dwarven acquaintance of ours stumbled on the auction. Zoltan. Huh. So Philippa was here under our noses the whole time? Was, precisely. Zoltan lost her in a card game a few days ago. Yep, that's Zoltan for you. A man showed up here, fleeced Zoltan Bear, then proposed they play for the owl. Naturally, he won, then politely thanked Zoltan for the game and left. Who was it? Know where he lives? He's not from here. No one knows him. Great. We got any leads? We have this. That Philip of the Owl's Feather? Thinking divination? Specifically hydromancy, and a form of sortilage. We need a fountain where we won't be disturbed. One outside the Passiflora could work. Good idea. Let's go. We're here. Nice and quiet. Shouldn't be any disturbances. Let's begin. Observe the water's surface carefully. We can't let anything go unnoticed. Graham et Duir, Robert Mekele, Alferte. Graham et Duir, De Agnes Kerle, Es Pirchena a Es Clace. Looks familiar. A bathhouse. I know the place. Dijkstra. He has her at his bathhouse. Might have guessed as much. Let's go to the bathhouse. Might not be too late. Come on. I hope we get there in time. I hope Dijkstra hasn't already hurt her. The possibilities are many. Could be Dijkstra that got hurt. Not likely. Dijkstra never forgave her for sending assassins after him. And Philip is weakened, no doubt about it. Weakened, maybe, but still a powerful sorceress. If Dijkstra's men take the Dimeridium off, Philip will kill them before they can say, oh shit. What does? Fire. Ah, fire. Guess they underestimated Philip, huh? Surrender! This place is a maze, witch! You'll never get out! Goddamn fools! After her! We'll handle this. Oh no, no, no! The sorceress stays here! Not a chance. It's fine, Gerald. I'll stay. In case she tries to flee this way. Fine. Be right back. Stomach ache. Mm. 
plague? Aye. But once old drowner ate... Her stomach aches like she just ate a hundred old drowners. But no one. Drowner make egg very bad. Let me pass. I can help her. But let pass go. Which of help? I want to help you. Help me die. Go for the breath. I'm not out to hurt you. Bollocks. You will not take me. I want to help you. Forgive me, but I just don't believe you. Long dead by now. What do you want? To torment me? To watch others do so? I need your help. Betray me, and I will. Relax. Not planning on it. Triss is outside. She'll explain everything. Deepest apologies, but the lady will come with me. Dijkstra, I don't have time for this. Get out of my way. I've no quarrel with you, Geralt, but Phil and I have lots to talk about. Remember the assassins you sent after me, darling Phil? A grave error. Such matters ought to be handled personally, as I will now demonstrate. I like you, Dijkstra. Don't make me hurt you. Save your threats for the rats that run about the port. They don't make the slightest impression on me. Philippa will come with me and answer for all the courtesies she's paid me. Always knew the value of information, Dijkstra. Which is why I don't believe you have anything I don't already know. The Emperor of Nilfgaard wasn't able to sway the Trade Corporation. Opposition nibbling at his ass, eh? Hmm. Seems the White Flame won't dance on the graves of his foes much longer. His daughter has returned. The Emperor wants to abdicate, give her the throne. Cyrilla? Impossible. This... This could shift the tide of war. Provided, of course, you're not mistaken. Emperor himself told me. So, information's first hand. Emir's a lying whore. When it comes to his daughter's future, doubt it. You've no idea of the importance of this information. A change on the Imperial throne could bring the war to an end. Radovid's sure to be delighted. If Emir sounds the retreat, there'll be no force left that could possibly stop that madman. Especially in light of our bloody aborted plan. You didn't actually believe you could do it. Radovid's crazy, but he's no idiot. Knows all too well there are dozens out there who... Silence. Do I understand you correctly? You want to kill Radovid? <laughs> well, Siggy, I am impressed. Doubted you still had it in you, frankly. Sadly, as you well know, Radovid has sought refuge on his boat. He's guarded so closely, I'd not be at all surprised to learn he shares his bed each night with two sentries. You know too much, Phil. 
Yet one more reason why you must die. Dijkstra, Philip is not gonna die. We're done discussing that. Forget about it. Situation's changed, Witcher. She's in a position now to foil my plans. Do you really think I will run to warn the man who gouged my eyes out? I think you might want to hear her out. Dare say Philippa despises Radovid at least as much as you do. I'm content someone apart from myself has finally gotten the idea to rid the world of the degenerate. Save your praise for others. I couldn't give a shit. Currently, only two individuals stand to draw Radovid off his boat. Emir and myself. You'd agree to be the bait? I fear you'd be hard-pressed to convince Emir to dangle himself as such. Fat fucking chance. Geralt, I wouldn't trust this cunt to hard-boil my eggs. Rightly so, I'm terrible with eggs. But think on this. Radovid hears that you've captured me. Will he not throw caution to the wind? Will he not jump at the chance to kill me? Personally, with his bare hands. Out of the question! Geralt, get her out of here before I burst her testicle! And then... Then we must meet with our friends. I've leased a warehouse port side. Be sure to come. Sorry to take so long, but I had to deal with the guards. Hello, Triss. Philip, are you all right? I've been better. I'll get you out of here. Gonna be all right? Yeah. Thanks for your help. Can I be of service? Got some coin I'd like to convert into crowns. You've come to the right place. A better rate you'll not find anywhere in the city. How can I be of service? How's business? Really? That's the best you've got. That's like asking a fisherman if they're biting, or an old gran about her health. Business is booming. There's profit to be made from war, provided you've the know-how. Before Nilfgaard had even crossed the Pontar, I'd contracted for insured deliveries of wood and iron from Covina, reaped a sevenfold return on my investment. Nice. So you might think, but then there's the non-human poll tax, the church's tithe, war taxes, and my overhead. Subtract all that and you're left with a pittance. A dozen or so chests, and no more. Till next time. Miserable. That's all great. Who kisses your ass? Washed your hair lately. All right. The pilot's dead. I'm afraid the dishwater's as good as it gets in this establishment. Imlareth, was that your idea or serious? Spare me your lecture about responsibility. I was actually going to recite an anthem praising your glory, but if you're not in the mood... I 
he'd be angry. Angry? Why? Because you supported Ciri in her decision? Or because you fought by her side and won? What if we'd lost? We wouldn't be having this conversation. And the female part of the continent's population would be drowning in tears. You won. No point bothering with what ifs. Hmm. Charming place. Why are you here? You'll find out soon. In the meantime, tell me about Philippa. Triss and I found her and freed her. It turned out Dijkstra had her, but the situation's under control. That's a relief. So, gonna tell me why you're here? I was able to establish Margarita's whereabouts, the prison in Oxenfurt. I also learned the identity of the man who escaped from there. He should arrive shortly. Talk to Triss. Reconvening the lodge? It's not going so well. Dangerous times, especially for sorceresses. Each thinks five times before sticking her neck out, and I can't blame them. What do you know about this fugitive? I know he's the only one ever to escape from Derhard. Every guardsman in the city now seeks him. Sure he can be trusted? We'll soon find out. He just walked in. Who's asking? We'd like to talk. Damn. Oh. <sighs> Best run and get him. You'd agreed to meet. I said I'd found him, not that I'd spoken to him. What do you want from me? Let me be. Calm down. We just want to chat. Uh -huh. And then stick a shift between my ribs. Leave me in the gutter. Look at us. Do we look like bandits to you? Uh, no. No, not really. I'm glad you agree. Besides, you'd be worthless to us dead. So you... you shan't hurt me. No. You're gonna tell us your story, then be on your way. Uh, oh, so be it. But we, uh, we really ought to go back to Kate's. It's unwise to linger in the street. Drink up. It'll help. Thanks. What do you want? To get into Derard. <laughs> Find a hunter. Tell them you practice magic. They'll they'll lock you up lickety split. We need to get in without anyone noticing. Tell us how you escaped, then get on with your life. They say no one gets out of Dayrod alive. Aye, uh, so they say. My thought? Why not try it dead? But they burn the corpses. They didn't start burning them until they'd learned an old fellow like myself had escaped. Before, they dropped the stiffs into a great pit. The pit's connected to the sewers, and the sewers empty into the river. And once you reach the river, you're as free as a fish. They say Dayrod's better guarded than the keep at Vicovaro. They choose the guards from among witch hunters. The worst dregs, rabid fanatics. If you only knew what they'd do to folk. Torture every day. The wheel, the rack. 
We only knew peace on holidays when they'd drink themselves blind. They're allowed to drink on duty? Oh, not officially, but you know how it is. So you played dead? No one caught on? As a youth, I'd apprentice with an apothecary in Silverton. Learned a thing or two about herbs. Sleeping mushrooms grew on the walls of my cell. And I found belladonna in the prison yard. Just had to mash them together and eat the pulp an hour before evening rounds. You might have lost your life. I'd prefer to die on my own terms were that to be my fate. So theoretically we could get in the way you got out. Assuming we don't mind the company of decomposing corpses. And assuming you can squeeze through the grate. They barred the outlet to the river after I escaped. Huh. Explosives could take care of that. For half the city to hear us? I have a better plan. Oxenfurt was built on elven ruins. Which have to connect to the sewers somewhere. If we can find a way into the ruins... We'll get into the prison. Wasn't so hard. One last bit of advice. Find a new tavern. Everyone here knows you. Thank you. Whatever your plans, I hope they work out. So do we. So long. What he said about the guards could prove handy. True. Things will go more smoothly if we can get even a few of them drunk. Zoltan ought to manage it. I'll ask him. Let's meet on the Oxenfurt Bridge. Something unusual. Mm. One drink all I had. Mum's an old sucker. Ah! Margarita at Dayrod. Got a plan to break her out, but we need your help. What should I do? Load a wagon with as much Mahakaman as you can find and drive it to Oxenford. Yennefer will give the signal. He'll drive through the gates and treat the guards. Oh, these are terrible times. Since the mage has left town, the hunters have taken to harassing non-humans. A dwarf flinging around the prison gates only stands to attract attention. Right. Didn't think of that. I'll go straight to Yen in that case. She went to find a way into the ruins beneath the city. Nice talking to you, Zoltan. See you later. Nearest is through a well not far from here. Did you arrange any help? We'll manage on our own. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Mark, the famed Geralt Riviera. Sure the guards don't know about the passage through the ruins? Haven't planted sentries there? They haven't. How can you be sure? Novograd's hierarchs have taken great care to eradicate any and all memories of the city's elven roots. Even if anyone remembers the ruins are there, they have no recollection of how far and where they extend. And I'm absolutely certain no one's thought to place sentries there. Hope you're right. He 
His Majesty oh. King Radovid is a stern ruler, well, but a just one. Here we are. This is it. Boulder hmm. was plugging the well until recently. Due to an edict Hemelfart issued some years ago. But I managed to find two brawny and obliging passers-by who agreed to remove the impediment. For a modest fee, naturally. Here. What is this? Use it once you find Rita. I'll be able to pinpoint your location. Not coming? Mucking through ruins and sewers? rather leave it to the expert. Meaning you'd rather waltz in once the hard work's done. Wet clothes. Enjoy. Mechanism's broken. Missing a piece. Replace it with something else, maybe? 